Hello everyone, my name's George Farmer, also known as the Aquascaper, and I'm going to talk about my latest Aquascape. This is a Superfish Expert 70. So it has a total volume of 70 litres, and the aquarium itself measures about 56 centimetres across, and I believe about 35 centimetres front to back, and about 35 tall. Um, it comes supplied with an 8 watt LED light unit, so fairly low lighting, and an internal filter with a rating of about 400 litres per hour, so fairly good turnover. I, I think the lighting's quite low, I did a PAR measurement um, which gave me about 10 at the substrate, so we are talking low lighting and I've tried to choose the plants accordingly. Um, the hardscape is a mixture of uh, Borneo driftwood I believe and Redmoor root, and I've got some Dragonstone in there as well. Um, <laughs> The red moor root tried to float, so you can probably just see a, a stone just rested on top there, which actually looks okay, so I'll probably leave it there. Um, Planting-wise, I've gone for a classic uh, slow-growing, easy foreground, uh, which is a cryptocorine parva. And then uh, one of my favourite plants at the moment is a Busophilandra. This is the green velvet version. Um, quite rare in the UK, it's a really, the Busophilandra species are getting really popular now. I've never grown it properly before, so I'm really looking forward to seeing how it develops in, in this tank. It's a slow-growing plant, similar to Anubius, and it's an epiphyte plant as well, so it does it does really well attached to attached to hardscape, so that's what I've done there. Uh, in the mid-ground, I've got a classic uh, Cryptocorine Menetii Brown, uh, again, really slow-growing and, and low light tolerance. Um, towards the back right there, you can see all the Cypress Hell Ferry, so it'll be interesting to see how that grows in, in the lighting. And then there's a couple of stem plants in there, you probably can't see them right now, but I've got a mixture of Rotala rotundifolia, Micranthemum ambrosum, and Bacopa compacta. So um, yeah, a nice mixture of stem plants in there just to give it a bit more of a jungly feel. So hopefully they'll all grow really well. Um, I'm using the Colombo range of plant and tank products, so uh, they're pro soil. Um, liquid fertilisers, so I'm using their Pro Fertiliser which contains NPK as well, so nitrates and phosphates which is really good news. And also um, I'm using uh, liquid carbon, so that will help plant growth even more. I will be fitting a CO2 kit as well, the pressurised CO2 kit which includes the brilliant 3-in-1 diffuser which I really love. So uh, thanks again to all my subscribers, I hope you enjoy what you see, if you do please share it with your friends on your social networks, um, I'll update all my aquascapes quite regularly so you can see the journey of all of them, I've got four on the go right now so it's going to keep me busy, so yeah keep on scaping, take care and I'll see you all soon, cheerio, bye bye.